All right, it's gonna be a quick video on the menu. Hit the menu button, notice it says record. It won't let you go into the menu until you stop recording. It's in standby. Hit the menu, use the mode button. That switches you between these down here. You have your video mode, picture, playback, uh, your SD card, and your options. Uh, the first thing I'm gonna do here go to the SD card uh, the record is the enter button format card yes okay so it takes everything off the card go over to mode uh, this is like your system options I'm gonna go to the clock Can worry too much about seconds. Okay, that sets that. Uh, you can have your format down here. Oops, wrong direction. Date format, the stamp. Uh, Flickr uh, is an option that helps when you're driving. Uh, if you know some cameras, when you're hitting bumps, it tends to flicker. I think it helps eliminate that. Uh, rotate. Power save, that's how soon the screen times out. Protect level. Uh, that's a good question. I don't really know what that is. Motion detection high. That's for the motion detection setting part. Uh, you can reset back to factory settings, the firmware version. That's back to the top. On the video mode, uh, your movies. I have mine turned down to the 1280 by 720 60 frames per second just because it's a smoother picture uh, with driving Oop. Bring the menu back up I'll just hit record bring that in the quality super fine and fine I'm just gonna leave it on super fine uh, the clip time that's your different options with how long it divides up the clips for what size video uh, it has, I just said it's a 10 minutes, the biggest one. Movie off time, five minutes. I'm pretty sure that's how long it records after it's sitting. I haven't tested this to see if it works yet, honestly. Uh, hopefully it would. Motion event record. Um, that would be, I'm actually going to change that over to one minute. Uh, I guess that's if the vehicle's just sitting and it has detects motion in the front. Um, sound record, that records your microphone inside, which I would leave on. Your sensitivity, in case you have a lot of road noise, you could change that. Scene, auto, I guess. And then you could change like your exposure and everything. Let's see, picture mode. I'll go through the menu quick, just so you can see it. But. I have no intention of ever taking a picture with this. I got a phone for that. Playback mode, that's your volume. You can delete individual files, a protected file. That's it in that. But it's pretty simple to use. Um, back out by hitting menu again. Uh, once you're done changing any settings, you can see the timestamp down here. Uh, that, I believe, that stamp right there is, um, oops, I think that's how much time you have left on your SD card. It says two hours, 13 minutes, and then you got it running right here, but you have to remember to record. Start it recording again. Otherwise, it won't continue to record once you turn the vehicle back on. It's going to, when you turn the vehicle on, it's going to go to whatever mode it was on. Um, like I was saying, if you have the screen up, you hit menu. See this little lock? It locks the file. Hit it again. Unlock files. I guess that's so it won't overwrite, like if something happened and you can't take it off soon enough or change the card or whatever. Um, that's that part. I guess on mode, I guess I would have to stop recording.
you can switch between the different modes like there's your picture mode you can zoom in and out and I guess you hit the record button to take a picture and it'll save it hit that mode again this is your playback mode Yeah, record. Recording again. Otherwise, it won't continue to record. Uh, that was me from before. Uh, pause it. Hit the mode again. Uh, let's see. Menu should bring you back. Yep. Mode. That brought into a picture mode for you. Look at the pictures. This brings you back to the beginning. Oh, you can hold the right button, and it turns the mic off. what this does. I'm holding the left button. I guess that's just a quick record if you're in standby. Uh, Say so if you're recording, you hit the menu button. You can hold this for four seconds and it'll shut it off. Not sure why I'd really want to shut it off. You just stop recording, but. Um. Hold it for four seconds and it'll boot back up and go back to the way it was. If you had uh, another thing hooked up to this that you wanted to use, when you have the screen up, you can hold record. You can see it says no signal on there. I don't have anything hooked up, but that's like a third input. You hold it and it just goes back to DVR mode. One thing I don't really like is uh, there's no way in the options here, at least that I've been able to figure out that say if you're driving forward to hit a button and look at your rear view camera without being in reverse. Like, see, it'll show it when you go into reverse, but you can't hit, like, a button to see what's behind you. You know, say if somebody was following you too close and you wanted to look at them or whatever. But uh, you might be able to override it because this automatically comes on. And if you remember watching my last video, I pointed out a little wire that you could put power to, and that causes this screen to come up like it's tricking the vehicle into thinking it's in reverse. And the whole time when you're doing that, it is still recording facing forward even when you go into reverse it does not record the screen of you backing up when you put it in reverse in DVR mode that was one thing that I kind of wish it did too uh, so that way if you backed into something or if somebody hit you while you were backing up you could show that you you know didn't hit them but anyway that's kind of a, a quickie over the menu options and, and stuff like that because the instruction booklet they give you with it is a regular printer piece of paper printed out the back sides empty and the inside left is just an overview of the parts that you get and the right is like a really quick thing on what the buttons do and like about the camera and stuff like that but uh it's poorly translated from Chinese.